Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to react to Uncle Buck. This is a movie request with someone on Patreon. You know who you are. I'm very excited to watch this. I actually have heard of this movie. I know it's a comedy and that's about it. I can only assume what it's about. My guess is that it's some goofy comedy family. Their uncle comes stay. He's a mess. Crazy things happen. Yeah, uh, yeah that's my guess. I don't know. It feels like a plot to multiple movies, but I've heard of this one because I know it's like classic. It's a like comedy, and I think I know. I, I I'm gonna. I know I'm gonna recognize the main actor that plays Uncle Buck. I can kind of picture him in my head, and I have no idea what his name is or what other movies he's been in. But I feel like I've seen images of this movie, or have in the past as childhood passing through channels on the TV, and it would pop up, and I would just recognize it, and while scrolling, that's. All I've got. But I'm excited for it. It's not that long. Um, and I'm just excited for a fun comedy right now. So, again, um, thank you for the person who requested this. You know who you are. And thank you, everyone else, for watching. I hope you enjoy this. And here we go. This is real old. Whoa. I thought this was, like, 90s or something. It's way older than 90s. This is a John Hughes movie? Is that the Hughes Entertainment? Because I've heard the name John Hughes. Yeah, this is feeling less like a comedy and more like a drama right now with this intro. I never got houses that have this little weird gate thing that's not a gate because it's like only just the one part and not actually around the front yard. Okay, was this a thing back in the day when the bus is actually just dropped you off at your house? I used to have to walk like 20 minutes from the bus stop. Macaulay, Macaulay Culkin? I didn't know he was in this movie. Get your bag off the table. People eat there. They eat on plates. Yeah. Just don't give me any crap, Maisie. Well, she's right, though. Oh, really? I thought that was a swear. Now you're thinking of shit. <laughs> well, now you said it. Damn. What's, yeah, so aggressive. A sixth grader chased me on a bike, and I was running. Then I got exhausted and fell down. Aw. Well, me with the shoe. Damn. Forget that we were perfectly happy. Damn. So thank them for getting treated like shit every day. I'm telling <laughs> on that one. Shut your face. Oh. Very nice, stereotypical teenage girl. Your book bag doesn't go on the floor. Oh, let's have a cow. <laughs> Damn. Oh, so aggressive. I'm supposed to kick us around. I'm an American. I have <laughs> Maze around. No, but you've said shit twice. Mm, true. Only once, for real. <laughs> I've got things to do than babysit you, you little stain. Oh, damn. Oh, like what? Hang out with friends you don't have? Ooh. Just shut up. Want to make me? Oh, he's ready to fight. When our mother figure isn't here. I'm in charge. I'm eating cheese puffs with cheese, canned cheese on it. You moron. Uh -huh. I don't know why we need boys at all. They're so loud. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut the dog out. Percy! What? The dog is hanging out in the... What is... What? It's so cute though. <laughs> Do you think they use, how do they, the way they use shops like. Such a bother. How do you find the time? <laughs> Damn. You're about ready to be beaten up. Hmm? Maisie, put that down. Did you win hockey yesterday? I didn't get home for two weeks. Damn. Parents do not seem to know their kids very well. <laughs> I guess you don't want a hockey stick for your birthday. <laughs> This is awkward. I'm going to take a week off work so you can interview new housekeepers. <laughs> I've had enough of your ugliness. <laughs> oh, really? Mm -hmm. We're all just a little tired. <laughs> He's showing him how he eats it. Well, the parents do seem to be not the best, but also the daughter is also kind of a bitch. 
yeah, this actor. Like, I recognize him, but I can't honestly say I know him from anything. That is the best formula for loneliness I ever heard. Why are we arguing? We're talking. I said I'd be at work in the morning. I'll be there. You don't need to have children to be happy. Just, I just gotta get this out. I mean, I know I'm kind of like oh, Lord. something here, but it, I mean, you know, I am. I'm mean, working on history. I'm working on the past. You're gonna show up for work. You swear to God in the A.M. Why promise. wouldn't he? If I could think of an excuse that you would buy, I'd use it. He's not gonna be there. Marcy, she's right across the street. <laughs> she's the last person I'd ask. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, this is just a thought. What about? Oh, sure he'd he's gonna come and watch the kids. This is not time to discuss your brother. I don't want his him. brother. Okay. It's just a suggestion. They don't look anything he alike. Have kids. He isn't married. He, he doesn't even work. Honestly, this couple here looks more like they could be siblings than Buck and him. The trashy people he hangs out with. The that woman who sells tires. Sells tires. Uh, horse. Okay. He's gonna call Buck instead. Thanks. Can they go see their I love my grandpa? Very much. So why did you move away from him? Yeah. My whole family moved away from me. I'd have a heart attack too. Damn. What happened with the grandfather and then they had to move away, but they're going back, but the kids can't go back for some reason? Uh-huh. Who's gonna take care of us? Mr. and Mrs. Neville? Is that a joke? <laughs> oh, damn. Not like the Nevilles. The dog's a ball sniffer. Oh, yeah. Talk. Mr. Neville yelled at Michael Larson because the dog was sniffing Michael's balls. Uh -huh. Use the word. <laughs> no one knows a word. Sorry, honey. They're in Florida. Time to call up okay. Buck. When you get in bed, you have to get up for school. Who's in Florida? Just get back in bed. Who's the other word for ball? <laughs> in bed. Love this kid. <laughs> with a Z. What do we do? I don't think we have much choice. Can we trust him? Probably not, but no other choice. Yeah. Buck, this is Bob. Bob. Babu. Uh -huh. uh, like your brother? Buck, it's your brother? <laughs> Bobby. Well, you are calling in the middle of the night, so he might... It, he's reasonably allowed to be disoriented. <laughs> Where does he live? Oh, <laughs> he's not a morning person. Okay. Uh, oh, my God! Bobby, yeah, just use your Christmas present. Uh, the he turns on the entire building. Jeez, what are you drunk? <laughs> We gotta get together. I haven't been over your house since you moved in. Well, actually, about that. Bush is new. I had no idea that they would all catch on fire like that. You know, you were <laughs> right. I should never have put the barbecue that close. Oh, but no. Cindy's father is stuck for somebody to watch them. If you're not doing anything. Is this uh, okay with Cindy? This has got her approval on it? Uh, approval's a strong word. Uh, that'd be great. That'd be, I'd, I'd be honored, sure. I, I've still got the one bedroom. You know, I'm going to get a bigger place. But, uh, hey, they bring their uh, sleeping bags over No, there. they want you to come to eat them. So we'll get some toys and some peanut butter. You know? <laughs> toys and peanut butter. Look at the dogs. Pack a few things. I'm on my way. Thanks. See you soon. You can do it. <laughs> she looks a little terrified. <laughs> At this hour. Uh, that's a good sign. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the low bar for Buck. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. oh. Oh. Ow. Hello. Shanice? Honey? Yeah, she's not going to believe him. I have some bad news. I guess. You are not coming into work in the morning. Mm. Just 
Let him speak. He has an actual valid excuse. Helping family out. Goodbye. <laughs> Damn. Oh boy, those kids. I haven't seen those kids in a while. That car is really jumpy. Nine, maybe ten. Oh boy. The two new ones. They're, uh... The two new ones. Larry and, uh... Larry. We go to the wrong place. Yeah, there's no lights on. I don't think this is the right place. It's like the old house. Bob. Bob. This isn't funny. Come on. Wake up. I'm freaking my ass. Oh, he's at he's across the street. Yo, Bobby! Black? Bob? Black. Behind you. Bob? Black. Bob? <laughs> Oh, now they wake up all the dogs. I would be actually very pissed if someone's on knock on the door at like 2 a.m. waking everyone up. Had to shave it off. Not well, not well. My dad, hard to say. All those medical terms, huh? What is it, an infarction or something like that? Those are the two doors. Look at that. Cigarettes, then I go to cigars, then I go to pipes, then I go to chewing tobacco, then I'm on to that nicotine. <laughs> wow, quite the plan. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, no, please. I, I've got lots of money. No. No, please. No. Look, I got the money, please. Where, what my money? Kids, all right. Where do you get it from? Will you please? Okay, I'll pay you back when we get home. No, he's like, wait, no, actually. It's comfortable for you. That'll be easy. Uh, I guess, sure. Do you have a plunger here? While I'm it would be hard not to be like, that. Go crazy if someone just me, left know, me a signed blank check. The things I'd be thinking about. Mm. Me crazy. I've been eating a lot of cheese for some reason. I don't know what it is. I'm <laughs> craving for the stuff. I think maybe that's an allergy or something. He's an odd one, isn't he? I forget that. We'll be back by that time. Okay then. This, this should do. I probably won't use any of them. They're clearly not going to be back in time for Miles' birthday. Oh. Okay, that Okay. Well, we're off. All right. Take care of yourself. Thanks a lot, bro. Okay. Yeah. All right. Really appreciate it. All right. Thanks. Oh, no. <laughs> don't go in for a kiss. Oh, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, these two are going to hate each other. This girl is going to go berserk on him. Oh. Maybe let's not touch that anything. Oh, fuck, oh, sweetie. He it didn't last a minute before breaking something. Yeah, she already hates him. What is he making? Okay, food all over the floor, man. Oh, he's so messy, I hate it. <laughs> you remember me? Wow. The the evil teenage stare is real in this one. Come on, sure you are. Everybody loves breakfast. You gotta have a good breakfast, start the day off right. Either he just made the worst thing in coffee or She's not actually a coffee drinker, and she's only doing it because her parents aren't here. There you go. Are you deaf? I said I wasn't hungry. <laughs> That's one of my specialties. Um, grapefruit, good. Toast, a little burnt. I don't mind that. I don't know what the other stuff is. Does your mom know you drink coffee? <laughs> I'm not doing it to impress you. It kind of feels Appreciate like it. That. Is there any particular reason why you're giving me such a hard time? No, just she's a teenager. 
giving you a hard time. Oh, well, I don't know. You are kind of acting hey, a little bitchy. How you doing? Who are you? <laughs> I'm your Uncle Buck. Do I have an uncle? Unfortunately. <laughs> Holy smokes. He cooked our garbage. <laughs> Hey, where's your, uh, your sister, um, uh... Her name is Maisie. Maisie. For the second time. <laughs> it, names are not always easy. You must be hungry. Just for you. Oh, my God. <laughs> Put onions in the eggs. Ooh, that's a, I like onions and eggs. I'll fix you some cereal when I get back. <laughs> Again, don't need to be a bitch about it. He's actually making some good foods out of cereal. Eggs with onions? Yes, please. <laughs> Evil child. Can I ask you something? What? Is your sister always this pleasant? No. Oh, yeah. She's usually in a bad mood in the morning. <laughs> this is her. Wow. Ow! Sonny. You want knots in your hair? Ow! Cut it out. I want mom to do it. Mom's not here. No, she's not. Annapolis. They did not. Okay, they didn't. They did? Oh my they god. Taking care of you. But you can't drive. Oh, uh, what do you go? What do you like? The city. The, the women in this family are a little nutty. At least the two girls are. Lots of things. Where's your office? I don't have one. He's nutty, but in a fun way. How come? It's a long story. <laughs> Kids? No, I don't. How come? It's an even longer story. <laughs> Play more dance questions. I'm a kid, that's my job. Yeah. Lovely interview. Oh, the outfits. Wow, all the hats and the scarves. It's a lot. His car, he needs to get that checked out. I would say normally teenagers would not be carrying this much, but that is a lot of smoke. Right, but also why are they just standing around? Move on. Oh god. Did it explode? Oh! Um, the embarrassment. Are you really this stupid? I said I would get a ride. I always get a ride. Hey, I'll just call the school, find out what time, and uh, meet you right yeah. here. Stand me up today. And tomorrow, I'll drive you to school in my robe and pajamas and walk you to your first class. Ooh, the threat. That's how okay. you do it. I love I'm it. I'm stunned that I'm related to you. I'm stunned that you're still... We're going to get along just fine. Oh, I love... I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to love him. No. <laughs> That's how you deal with a teenager. You just gotta be ruthless right back to them. At least all the kids are gone. Where'd they all go? You think she hates me? Just a pastor. Yep. <laughs> you think it's the hat? No. no. Everything. A lot of and breaking plans. What are you talking about, huh? Didn't we talk last night? Did we talk last night, huh? About this? Not really. What she kind of shouted at you and you got no woods in. Father. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm really glad that you can do it for your brother. You sure as hell can't do it for me. How you might actually you? like this because he might actually want kids after this. Look, I have to fill the position. It's important to the company. It's important to me to swamp down here. I don't blame her for that, but also you don't have to be such a bitch about it. My mind and, uh, you know, we'll see where we are at that point. Okay, well, I have to go now. Bye-bye, hun. <laughs> she is so done with him. Ew. Damn. Unilateral cut in the Soviet military. Smiles and waves with this He just has the vacuum right next to him to clean up his shirt. The level here of laziness, but ingenious, too. Stock market has its best week since July. Take that, Karl Marx. <laughs> okay. Aw, doggy.
Oh, old school's lunches. Oh. What did he give him for lunch? What the fuck is that? What is this? I don't recognize any of this besides the milk in a weird jar. Would you like to talk about a possible lunch trade? <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Oh, was he, was he there on that part of the photo? Ooh, that's mean. Like, is it that hard to just have him in the photo? Do you hate him that much? Ooh. Who is this boy with the beret? Cover your ears. What the fuck? Don't just do it, homie. You ever hear of a tuna? <laughs> <laughs> you ever hear of a ritual killing? <laughs> <laughs> now that's a comeback. Get it. Love him. Her face look like that again and you'll be one. Damn. <laughs> 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 oh, oh. Are you crazy? I can be. You could have taken his head off. Yeah, but what do you notice? <laughs> we get something straight. Then that you stay out of my personal life. Do your parents stay out of your personal life? They don't know my personal life. That's true. They know nothing about the children. His name is Bug. Bug? First or last? First. Uh. His last name is Spray. <laughs> That's true. Buck's also kind of odd. But I prefer a buck of a bug. Like, who names a child that? Oh, this is giving some Home Alone here. Was this before or after Home Alone? It's giving after? What if we get one of your dolls and put your dad's pajamas on? No. She wants him to put his her dad's pajamas on and lay with her or something? You don't want to sleep with me. Oh. Yeah, I I wouldn't I'd be a little weird out too. You barely know. Why do you everything around here? <laughs> Apparently. Yo. Hi, Yo. Sorry. I'm learning my teeth. Uncle Buck's got me busting my hops. Yeah. He says a lot of hard work with good for him, I said. <laughs> That's true. Good for you. Mom. Why don't you hire a murderer to watch <laughs> Damn. Well, he systematically dismantles my life. Another drawback is that uh, I'm a big drooler. <laughs> He's really trying to convince her not to want to sleep in bed with him. The guy took off today and left Miles and Maisie alone. Plus, he drinks. Oh my god, the lying to try to get Uncle Buck a job when he's actually doing a good job. Now I have a friend who works at the crime lab at the police station. Oh. I could give him, you could run a test on it to see if you actually brushed your teeth or just ran your toothbrush under the faucet. Ooh. Sneaky, I like it. Gaslighting and lying to children. Best things. That's Truly fun. True. We're going to really have to start brushing our teeth. <laughs> how, how many times a day... Do you think he eats? Four or five. Wow. I should have told you that he eats once, yeah. once a day. Only once, wow. The water? Yes, yes, he drinks water. I would keep some water out. I've been leaving the, the toilet seats up. Oh. <laughs> yeah. These are valid questions that you should have probably left some instructions to take care of the dog. Huh? Oh, oh, God. That, that might account for something. Mm -hmm. Nothing. He's honest. Thank you very much. Okay, bye-bye. Uh, she's freaking out. Bob! <laughs> Bob! Oh, no. I would... I, I could never. <laughs> Kids always know how to take up the bed. Dogs, too. Oh, 
<laughs> Just go move to a different bed now. They're asleep. Or sleep on the floor. There you go. They're gonna join him on the floor. My god. Children. What, what is wrong with them? Who is this creeper just walk into the house? Who leaves these doors unlocked? I get it back in the day, but like, still. Just in case. Hello? What is this outfit? It's hideous. Oh lord. With the bandana, the the browns. Get ready, here I come. Come on. What do I have to talk dirty to you? <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. Come on, it's nice and easy. Come on, here we go. Come on, you don't want to throw a do you? Open up! Come on! Oh my god. That sounds so wrong. <laughs> Who are you and how do you know her father had a heart attack? I'm her brother in law. Oh yeah? Who are you talking dirty to? What? <laughs> Go. And you thought that. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> okay. Boy, that's funny. Who are you now? You're gonna ask I her? The oh, okay. My name is Marcy. Marcy. Marcy Dahlgren Frost. Dahlgren Frost? Frost is my married name. I'm single again, but I never bothered to lose the Frost. Okay. Good for and I you. Compliments on the hyphen. I sure you were. Sure you were. Yeah. Came to invite Cindy to lunch, but since she's not here, do you have plans? What? You well, actually, inviting him to lunch? Things to do around here, you know. Rain check? She's a little bit room. intense. See ya? What'd you blow all that makeup for? We're going bowling. <coughs> I'm not going bowling. Yeah, I have a feeling she don't want, wouldn't want to go. It's impossible to get pregnant while doing it. That's my drift. <laughs> How'd you like to spend the next several nights wondering if you're crazy, out of work, bum uncle? We'll shave your head. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy and I love it. <laughs> Here's his own bowling ball, of course. All right, grown man. No, don't walk to the teenage girl. Creeper. Ugh, black eye. Ew, 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 get away. Oh, what? Ew, 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 ew. Oh, comma, the bitch. I've never seen you here before. I know about everybody. That's why they call me pal. It's not impressive like you think it is. You must be a college student, right? Cheerleader, probably. You look firm. Ew. You look firm? You like all terrain vehicles? What? You got a brand right out in the parking lot. Red. Wanna go for a ride? Oh, oh, uh, don't stop right there. Oh, there we go. Come on. Oh. The object of the game were to get the ball as close to the pins without knocking any of them over. Shoot. You would be champion of the world. She really would be. That is a skill. I've never seen that happen before. Oh, mm. I got a cure for that. Ew. <laughs> oh, he knows him. Yeah. Yeah, well, you're not going to get any strikes in there, are you? Move it. Go on, get out. How do they know each other? Shithead. How does he know all these people? Just because of bowling? Yeah, this is Raj. Raj Tia. Hi, how are you? E. Roger Coswell. 
I'm not. They ain't gonna bite. You could be a little nicer, girl. Just like say hi, polite. Our link letter was right. Kids do say the goddamn these things. <laughs> Is Shanice here? Um, no, so he doesn't actually letter. live far from yeah, them. They actually live pretty close to each other, it seems. Cute kid. Jimmy Bean called. Jimmy Bean, like oh, yeah. sausages, sandwiches. Consider this, Buck. With this score, your whole year is covered. Yeah, huh? gambling. You just don't. It's too risky. Object has come up, yes, but uh, nothing serious. Maybe if you got married, you'd stop being such an asshole. Oh my God, do you have to be such a bitch? Maybe you get married, you won't be a bitch. I will. I'll get it nice and juicy for you. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. It's a bit extra, like, I don't think it's necessary, but also, congrats for somehow doing that in the shuffle. Here you go. Shit. I got you now. Hey, Jimmy. How are you even cooking this? Like, how, how is this thing hot? What are you cooking it on? Oh, it's for his birthday. That's so okay. That's sweet. Giant pancakes. I hope you're hungry. <laughs> you should see the toast. I couldn't even get it through the door. <laughs> that is. That's. That's nice. Who is that? Uh, clown. What clown? Miles's mom hired a clown. Oh. Oh no. See a drunk clown? And clowns are ugh, so creepy. No kid likes clowns. Sorry if you do, but I hate them. So drunk. A clown, Can't impress you don't like clowns? Yeah, about five years ago. I was so boring to make me puke. And this clown might actually puke. This all night bachelorette party. Hey, you doing any dildo jokes? <laughs> I'm the guy. Uh, maybe not. What did you have? A few drinks this morning? Oh, uh, many. Huh? I think you did, didn't you? Who, Mother Cabrini? You never touched this guy? Who's that? No, no. Mother Cabrini? Drink if I was going to entertain some kids. Maybe right? I don't have Fair. Shit from you. In the field of local live home entertainment. Oh my God! No, you're a clown. Literally. Hey, you. Uh, let me tell you something, you low life. Oh, Lord. Four flushing sack of shit. Oh! Oh, he jumped. Bounced right back. <laughs> oh, and a second. We're skipping through a lot of time here. How long have the pants been gone? Why? I mean, Waller. What do you think? She doesn't want to, though, clearly. All the big hair, the berets, the name Bug. His name is Bug. I just don't feel right yet. You know, that's fine. She's not into it right now. She's not prepared. Fine. You better listen. Pick up here. She's at a cheerleader's house having dinner. No, she's well, not. So she says. Since when do cheerleaders live in the woods? Uh, how does he know where she is? Uh, ew. She's not. No. Go. Don't do it just because you don't want to go home. Yep. That's. <laughs> you always know when he's there. This outfit, what is this necklace too with the turtlenecks? Why is everyone wearing turtlenecks in this time? They certainly are scraping the bottom of the barrel for cheerleaders these days. <laughs> <laughs> Who said anything about that? I just thought you'd like to join us for some ice cream. He's just letting you know he knows where you are. We can talk about burying the hatchet. <laughs> you know what a hatchet is, don't you, Bug? Uh, you know, a situation may come up, say, uh, uh, for example, someone's been uh, drinking and about to drive a loved one home. Ooh. <laughs> Then, no, I haven't. Not to mm -hmm. kill. No, no, not to kill. Just no, of course. Maim. Yeah. Take a little off the just shoulder. 
seriously injure. Not to kill. Shave a little meat off the old kneecap. <laughs> Ooh. You got both kneecaps? <laughs> I like Bugs about to bug out. Sharp enough you can shave with them. Why well, I've been known to circumcise a nap. <laughs> <laughs> You're not a nap. Is it a pee's pants? Wait a minute. Bug? Nap? Oh. Is there a little similarity there? Mm-hmm. <laughs> You understand what I'm talking about? The music in the background, really. I think you'd better split. You know, I don't exactly want him going berserk with an axe on me. He's all talk. Here it is. <laughs> is he, though? Come on, I want to show it to you. <laughs> Maybe later. Okay. <laughs> you got your message across. Just relax. I'll get him back. He's really just trying to help. He's actually doing a really good job and is being very protective of his nieces and nephews. And I like that. That's a pretty stupid thing to do during flu season. <laughs> I bet she's getting her tongue. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Just the looks at each other. But someone who wants to is working at an auto like auto repair place. What is wrong with this car? Okay. Oh, what what is he doing? Oh God. Um, can you smoke a cigar at a school, even in this time? <laughs> you s allowed to walk around a school without, like, going through a front office, like, without visitors pass? Oh, God. <laughs> Little kids just in here. Can't wait throw it down the garbage. Oh, you're gonna light a fire in here. Oh, yeah, that works. Yeah, get it wet and then put it in the trash can. But um what if one of the kids grabs it from the trash can? <laughs> the little <laughs> Well, wow, the, um, it's low. There's no adult bathrooms here that you could use. <laughs> Gonna work at it and soon squats here. <laughs> On your knees? Oh my god. Oh, wow. What's on her face? <laughs> Morning. What do the kids do? What happened? Yeah, it's hard not to look at that. It's hard. Floor, really hard. Buck melanoma. Uh -huh. Only Russell's wart. <laughs> not her wart. Not her wart. I'm I'm the wart. She's my tumor. Oh my, my god. <laughs> my uh, my pimple. I'm Uncle Wart. Oh my it's god. Uncle Wart Russell. That's what they call me. Or uh, melanoma head. They'll call me that. Oh lord. Shh. Shh. Stop talking. I'm sorry. Uh, Uncle. Maisie Russell. I can't stop Uncle looking, Uncle. but I don't want to look. It's so gross. I've been an educator for 31.3 years. Point three. Time, Who says point three? A lot of when I look at your niece, she is a twiddler, really? a dreamer, a silly heart. What's wrong with that? Jabberbox. I was gonna say I thought they were about to go with the boy, but like the girl, really? Makes a thing in her life or her career as a student. Seriously. Wow, you're gonna call her a bad egg? You have to have meaning for this. 
Um, it's a fairly valid excuse. She's not killing people. And I sure don't want to know one who takes their student career seriously. Yeah, really? I don't have a college degree. I don't even have a job. <laughs> Does anyone have a special story to tell a class about something that happened this week? Wait, is that what's her name from my girl right there, the little girl my next to her? My microwaved in my socks and the dog threw up on the couch for about an hour. Wow. Honest, why is your uncle microwaving your socks? Can't get the goddamn washing machine to work. Mm -hmm. Blasphemer! What? what? Oh, the acting there. The way he shouted that was weird. Oh, that was uncomfortable. I'll brain dead skags like you. Drag them down and convince them they're no good. <laughs> this you kid. so much as take this quarter. Go downtown and have a rat gnaw that thing in the <laughs> face. <laughs> Damn. He is savage. Nick? <laughs> Destroyed her. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing out here making all this noise? Ah, oh, God. Get in the house where you belong. Come on. Come on. Hey. I didn't realize they had a cat. Get a cat out. That's what I thought. Shoot, 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 shoot. Locked him out. Oh, God. Hey. But you gotta do what you gotta do. A prank is a prank, and it's a good one. Classic. Hi. May I have to speak to Buck Russell? It's a friend of his. She wants to call out to you. Oh, what's she gonna do? Well, can you tell me when he's gonna be back? He went out with Lars who oh, lives across the street. Girl. They bitch. Stay out pretty late. Really? He's actually trying to be like, a message? he may be aggressive, but he's doing like nice things and trying to protect you when you go try to ruin his life. Um, no, there's no message. Teenagers are so ungrateful. Ruthless. That make you feel good about yourself. That make you happy. Pissing this woman off, making her unhappy, ruining Buck's day and life. Oh, Buck. You couldn't ask the neighbor lady how to work it? You couldn't have asked her to be like, hey, can you show me how to open this? Ew. This does not feel sanitary. Don't let it be true. <laughs> it, it sadly is. Oh my. Again, these outfits. Wow. The uh, laundry, what's it look like? This one's a little better than the last one, but still not great. Stars. You don't know what you're doing. Really, you're though. You're bored out of your mind. You need a little adult what? Excuse me? The way you said that. Oh. No. Such bad timing. Always. Just do it. Yeah, do it so she leaves. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. What is wrong with this lady? Oh, God. What is this dance move? Like, hu yeah, humping is like, like a dog would. It's something. It should be illegal. Oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Making me dizzy here. Oh, oh, oh. Ouch. Oh, God. Again, what's with the keeping the doors unlocked? Yeah, dancing with another woman. And it's the woman that you were told last night she went out with, too. Honest, honest, honest. I'm telling you the truth. You son of a bitch. 
Don't say that, okay? Shanice, don't walk away like Shanice! Shanice! At least hear him out, please. Shanice! Come on! I love you! <laughs> don't wait for that. But really, why, why do they always just run away instead of just listening for a moment? There could be a reasonable explanation. And there is one. This lady's crazy and the teenager is fucking him up. And over. Oh, what flew up her nose? <laughs> so, I'll just go home and wait for the Federal Express man. Oh, okay, good for you. Now that everything's okay with my grandfather... I want to go out tomorrow night. You can go crazy after I leave. Until then, I'm not letting you out. Mm -hmm. He takes his job seriously here. Find any way to be cool, can you? Well, you mean easy? No. I mm. mean decent. You mean blind. Yeah, he, you just want him to... to points with? My parents? Maybe a little bit. How many times have they had to have a bad day today? Damn. It hurts when someone screws with your life, doesn't it? There's a difference, though, child. I would be so petty. On her, I'll get such revenge. There you go. Um, maybe no. Oh, for your little boy. Oh, he's very cute, though. This dog is adorable. I feel like you don't see dogs like that anymore. It's just like fluffy haired mutts. Nobody says that anymore. Don't let this teenager pull you down, Buck. Oh boy. You can still still get your go back. Oh. Yeah. Wasn't that the bowling I said it was like on Friday? So has this really only been like a week? Sunday. Sunday. Today. Friday. Where are you going all weekend? Jumbo party. Uh -huh. Put that on the flyer and show that I caught. <laughs> She's gonna be murdered by Buck. And he's not gonna go to the the thing because he's gonna be hunting her down. I'm waiting for the Tia to eventually realize how much she does care about Buck. Because he actually cares enough to say something and do something for Tia instead of her parents. Just let her do whatever. And she promised me she was going to look after you guys this evening? She promised me. Yeah. So much for promise. A teenager's promise. Very reliable. Well, I know, I know you two guys. <laughs> I know. You know. This is how I make my living. This, is, this, this was very important to me. Maybe get a job, dude. It may be peanuts to your dad, but it's my living. I have no choice. I don't care what your parents are going to oh, say. Oh, no. I, I, I have don't to take, you with me take to him to the tracks. To a racetrack. Oh, no. Beautiful horses, interesting people. And he went from serious corn, right? <laughs> Sometimes, yeah, but that's not the real reason people go there. Yes, it is. People go because she said she was going to a party. She said she'd be back Sunday. It must be a slumber party. <sighs> Yeah, you can't go to the tracks knowing she's there. You gotta go get her. You know what you've gotta do. Screw the track, the money. Go get Tia. Protect her. Whether she wants it or not. It's your responsibility. You need somebody to watch the kids. No, I'll tell you what you need. Your horse fixer's in town, and you need to get to the track. I ran into Ooh. Rod. See, he told me all. Oh. The nerve to ask me for a loan. What's Damn. Matter? You can't take children with you. Are you going to cheat on a horse race? Apparently I not. Yeah. Out there in the burbs. <laughs> came close. I so I thought it was about Tia. It's not the track. Damn. Come Can on, we Buck. Put our personal problems aside for a second. Tia took off on me. Or is it about I'm Tia? Supposed to pick her up at fifteen. She's angry. She's confused. And I need to find her. Yeah. Can you help me? Yeah, I guess she doesn't want to take the kids to go looking for her. All right, all right. I will help you because there's kids involved in this. But as Fair. far as you and I are concerned, it's 
I'm happy she's like not fuck no. He, she's has to be. reasonable. She's like this is for the kids. It's. I'll be there. I'm gonna find Bugs Place. Car's on fire. Car's on fire. No, 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 no. It's just a little oil. Uh -huh. I'm looking for a that hat on. They'll kill you. Uh -huh. Yeah. Thanks for the tip. So keep the hat on. <clears throat> That's what I heard. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's just staring, sitting there with the step stool and snacks. Oh God, who the fuck are they? I'm, I'm supposed to come over and watch you. Did he just like imagine three men there? Hi, uh, I'm Shanice Kovalovsky, I'm Uncle Buck's friend. May I see your driver's license, ma'am? Fair. <laughs> Was that supposed to be like a Home Alone nod there? With the guys at the door. <laughs> well, you gotta do what we gotta do. Safety first. She, he's gonna embarrass her like no one has ever been embarrassed before. She is not prepared for it. I don't think that's Tia. Bug is about to freak when he hears that sound. <laughs> Everyone drops. The, all the hats and the hair, it is all the black too. It, it's crazy. The berets. The, such bad looks. Oh, God. The fact that they haven't showed us her face means I don't think it's her. Oh, wait. No. Kind of sounds like her. Never mind. Dude, stop. She says no. Uh <laughs> mm -hmm. hip hip guy. Yeah, they make fun of his hat. Have they seen all of theirs? Hey, this room's taken. I'm gonna go. No, you don't. You better that die, bug. But he's ass. Did you hear me? You're a dead bug. There's no idea how dead he is. A whole movie. Drilling. Oh, oh my god. Did he come with a drill? Did he find a drill? Uh, you're about to get all new holes in your body. Yep, I knew it wasn't her. But damn, where's Tia then? Go get away while you can. Don't don't go with Bug. It's Bug. Uh huh. Oh my God, he's so scary. Where is Tia? She's just wandering around at night alone. Does not seem safe. Oh, he found her. Did he like did she like catch bug cheating? Did a bug break up with her? Everything you said would happen happened. Yeah. Sometimes you gotta realize that adults know more than you when you're a kid. It's hard to realize until it happens.
What is that thing on the steering wheel? I'm riding your butt all week about how you live your life. What exactly happened though with her and why they moved and everything? We still haven't learned that. Did such a great job earning your trust and admiration. I'm confused why I can't do the same with Shanice. Mm -hmm. Remino complicated. It's confusing. Sorry about this is the sweet moment that I was like waiting for between the two of them. Did you do anything to Bud? <laughs> what did you do? Oh my god. He's been in the trunk the whole time. Here. You were fine. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! That's... Okay, asshole! Oh, God. I'm sorry! That's I... not a good apology. Uh, I'm an amateur dentist. Oh. Oh, yes, he is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Be real now. Mm-hmm. Where are you dropping them off? Yeah, well, come on back and I'll kick your ass, man. Will you? Will you? Nope, yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't talk shit. Don't do something you can't like back up. Will you now? You gonna kick his ass too, like you just said? Let's see if you can handle the call. Can you kick the call's ass? He doesn't care if you haven't learned that yet. What? What are you doing, man? Someone's gotta teach you a lesson. Good luck with that. Oh, nice hit. Sucks. <laughs> yeah, you better run. What do you see in that guy? Yeah, really. Don't answer. Don't answer. Yeah, his name right away should have been a. The biggest red flag. If he does, he'd never say it. But what if he did? Then I would suspect he needed a new set of pals. <laughs> Seriously. He's not good with his emotions. Talk about that. But I don't think you understand the bigger picture. It's a box of charming men who wants to remain a boy for a while. Yeah, Peter Pan syndrome. Hey, if that doesn't make for a lasting relationship. That's well, true. I think he'd make a wonderful husband and father. He would make a great father, you can tell. He's responsible, caring, and loving. <laughs> a little bit of a script here. Humble, and honest, and <laughs> right. And he's really got a great sense of humor. Oh my god. <laughs> by any chance picked you up for this. Yeah. No, no. No, I've just gathered this from my own observations. Yeah, yeah as teenagers do. Oh, Suddenly give years. compliments, a list of compliments. <clears throat> oh, yeah. So am I. <laughs> uh, oh, oh. Damn, sent him flying. <laughs> She's strong. Gee, I love you, you know, I, and it wasn't for tires, sweetheart. Mm -hmm. It was for shocks, remember? <laughs> Buck. What crazy thing do you have to do? What happened to you? Obsessive genes keeps every nine generations. Every nine generations. How's it feel with the kids? 
Yeah. yeah. I think he's starting to learn that he kind of likes it. Yeah, we should have done this a long time ago, Steve. Should have? <laughs> you were ready to get killed. <laughs> oh, pants are back. <laughs> what about the dad? He's not coming in. <laughs> Just the stand there. It's so like, what the fuck? Are you about to kill me? The look of... Come on. There we go. I think the daughter finally understands the mom a bit more. She understands how hard it's been. They needed that little moment. <laughs> yeah, they both need to step up. The mom needs to, they both need to be a little more. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Almost made it, almost. Minutes away from being done. Shit. <laughs> hey, uh, next time you're downtown, maybe we can uh, go out for a coffee. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's kind of ridiculous. But we did leave the house oh, a little geez. messy. We did try our best. You know, we're not so good at <laughs> what? We're going home. We're not dying. Okay, let's say goodbye. Is that all right? Okay, you see, listen, tell the neighbors we're really sorry about having that thing parked in the driveway all week. <laughs> Ah, he's doing the job. He's getting a new car, yay. <laughs> he came in, he did his job. He did good. <laughs> this was a... S this was a sweet movie. I was really expecting, like, a full, like, kind of raunchy comedy with, like, ridiculousness of, like, it's the holidays and the Uncle Buck is in town and gonna cause chaos. There was a little bit of that, but it was mostly very sweet. He did, he came and he protected his niece and nephew and did what he needed to do. He did, he was asked to help out, he helped out. He stepped up, he did it. He, there was some roadblocks there was a few bumps in the road but he figured it out and he did an overall really good job besides um destroying the plate and right away and then right at the end the sink and the whole island that was a little bit of a mess but other than that he made he changed that teenage girl's life and really changed the way she viewed everything and her mom and i think it's a big stepping point and turn for both the mom and the daughter and that things will change and they'll both gonna try a little more and Buck kind of had this thing with his girlfriend um and I think it helped their relationship too to see that he is responsible and for him to see that he can do it and he kind of likes it to be married a parent live in a house I'm like I I think good for him that he maybe needs to settle down and be an adult and he's taking the job good for him oh that was a good movie so funny though too the jokes Buck with with um Bug hilarious. The way the way he always like had something back to say if you're like, I swear to God. <laughs> uh, you think you you think you're gonna one up? I'm gonna you you take one step to go at me, I'm gonna take ten steps. Like he takes to the next level and I love it. The the gaslighting of the children, the but then he did like adorable things of like making those giant pancakes for the boy's birthday. It was just it was cute and funny and Great. I loved it. Very surprising to me. I was not expecting this from this movie, but enjoyable. I would watch it again for sure. Like, this is a fun one I could see myself watching once a year kind of thing. Very fun. Alright, so I'm gonna thank the person who requested us on Patreon. You know who you are. Thank you very much. This was quite a surprise and joy. Loved it. And, uh, thank every... Uh, 
I want to thank everyone in general for posting a request of this um, on YouTube, on Patreon, everyone for all the support and the love. It really means a lot to have you guys supporting me. It really makes the time, the effort, every weekend and everything filming. We only have, as of filming this right now, I have, I think, seven more weeks. Four, yeah, I think seven or eight. Eight, I think. More weeks of school left, of work. And then I have the summer off, and I'm going to get so much done for you guys. I'm so excited. I'm trying to change things up a little bit and, like, kind of update everything, upgrade the channel in a, in a way. I'm still figuring that out completely, but I'm just letting you know. Um, by the time you're watching this, is a call, stuff could have already happened. I don't know. So, just, yeah. And just really appreciate all the support from you guys. It really does make it worth it. It makes me happy to see you guys happy and enjoying my reactions and talking with you guys so don't forget always comment down below because I love talking to you guys and seeing your thoughts and opinions fun facts about everything I watch that I wouldn't know otherwise it's, it's fun to know okay say hi you can just say hi if you want to and I'll say hi back talk about anything I'm an open book um, we can just hang out and talk I'm hoping this summer to do some lives for the first time to kind of just have fun and maybe get to know you guys a little more and you guys get to know me a little more. Okay? So, thank you for watching once more and hope you are having a fantastic day. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.